Hi, welcome back to my channel Pi by Me Maths. This is by Juvas Devan. Question number three. Figure one shows a sketch of the curve with the equation y is equal to square root of 3x over 3x square plus 5. The finite region R shown shaded in figure 1 is bounded by the curve, the x-axis and the lines with the equation x is equal to square root of 5 and x is equal to 5. The region R is rotated through 360 degree about the x-axis. Use integration to find the exact volume of the solid generated. Give your answer in the form A, L and B where A is an irrational number and B is a prime number. This question got 5 marks. So here we need to find the volume of the solid of revolution. That means if you take the 3D shape, rotate around the x-axis 360 degree, it forms a solid, right? A 3D shape, we need to find the volume of the 3D shape. The formula to find the volume is pi integral y square dx. The limit is square root of 5 to 5. So it's pi integral square root of 5 to 5, square this, y square, so the square root will be gone, 3x square plus 5dx. How are we going to integrate this function? You must have learned something called reverse chain rule to integrate this. Because the derivative of this is, the derivative of this is basically 6x, so you have 6x on top. You can multiply this by 2 to get a 6x, right? So you can apply reverse chain rule. So I'm going to take u as 3x square plus 5. du over dx is 6x. So basically du over 6 is x dx. So I'm going to replace everything in terms of u here. Integral. This is denominator is u 3 times x dx is du over 6, du over 6. So whenever you convert this, you can convert the limits also, that would be a lot easier. So if x is root 5, u is going to be root 5 whole square, which is 5, 3 times 5, 15 plus 5, 20. If x is 5, 5 square, 25, 75, 80. So the new limits will be 20 to 80, this 3 over u and du over 6. If you don't want to change the limit, you can keep the same limits. But in that case, after the integration, you have to replace u back to this and sub in the x limits. Here you don't need to do that. Just integrate, straight away plug in the limits. 3 over 6 is 1 over 2, so pi over 2. 1 over u du, integral of 1 over u is ln u. So the limit is 20 to 80. Sub in the upper limit. Do not replace e, u back to this because we have changed the limit already. These limits are mean for u now. So it's pi over 2 ln 80 minus ln 20. So it's going to be ln 80 over 20 is ln 4. The answer is pi over 2 ln 4. They want the answer in this form, a ln b, but if you read the question carefully, a is an irrational number, so this is an irrational number. b should be a prime number, 4 is not a prime number. So we are going to write 4 as 2 square, so you can write this pi over 2 ln 2 square. By applying laws of logarithm, put this power in front, so it becomes pi over 2 times 2 is pi ln 2. This looks exactly like this where a is an irrational number, b is a prime number. 